Hello everyone, welcome back to some more Resident Evil 2 The Remake. It's been a little while since we were last playing this game. We finished Claire's campaign and uh, not touched it since. So, we're going to dive right in. We're going to do the Leon side of the game now. Um, we're going to do it on Hardcore as well, because why not? Probably going to regret that. Um, but first, I'm going to change something here. We're going to go for a different audio, which was something I got with this version of the game. We can go to the original music and sound effects, which will be so much fun for those who have played the original and have nostalgia for that. I think that will be pretty awesome. And th quite a few people suggested this, actually. Um, the key one, the first one, I remember, was Jay Jammer, so thank you, dude. We're going to go with this. And I think... The rest of the settings are okay, so... Let us begin once again with Resident Evil 2. So far, still my game of the year. I freaking love it. Um, we do have some bonuses here, but I don't think... Yeah, no, it's just concept art and stuff. And we have uh, extra modes as well. The extra modes contain spoilers for the main story. Okay, well, yeah, we've... Um, we have done the story, kind of, but I'm not going to do any of this stuff just yet. Holy damn, that's an interesting pose. Um, so, story. We have the second run mode, which I will probably do if you guys want to see it. But we're just going to crack on with a new game. And we're going to be Leon S. Kennedy. After a few days of radio silence from his new post, Leon S. Kennedy drives to Raccoon City to scope things out. Unbeknownst to him, a nightmare awaits. Now, yes, I've heard that this isn't too different from Claire's. Enemy different, uh, enemy, enemy, enemy different, what? Enemies, uh, are gonna be in different places, perhaps. There's gonna be a few different story beats, uh, if the original's anything to go by. But we're gonna, we're gonna justify this by doing it on hardcore, so... Saving requires ink ribbons, very classic resi stuff, no auto saves, and the enemies are a lot stronger. Now, I have beaten Claire uh, in normal and hardcore. It was very tough. So, I don't know how this is going to go. I really don't. Now, certain parts of the game are going to be very familiar, others not so much. I guess we'll give it a try. And I hope you guys enjoy the ride. So, Raccoon City, an industrial city in the heart of America. Uh, he's been assigned to protect and serve, and I couldn't read it all. Look, man, I'm serious, okay? I saw this with my own eyes. Oh, I believe you, buddy. I believe you. <laughs> Just tell us a story. Tell us a story. Okay. So it looks like was, night, this opening cutscene is going to be very similar the with the trucker and his me. very tasty burger. So, I, I so forgive me if I talk over some of this, because we've already seen it. Okay, tell us, be honest now. So I don't know if I should really skip it or not, but... Eh, whatever. I don't want to accidentally skip something in case it did turn out to be different, so... But yeah, that's one tasty burger. Full of... Artery-clogging goodness. Sounds like my wife. Oh man, I've been so excited to play this again. I really have. I haven't really touched it since I did finish Claire on Hardcore, so I kind of wanted the game to be a little bit fresher for me again, so I might have forgotten certain things, might make it more fun for you guys. Just getting good. And uh, the Hardcore difficulty will definitely be a challenge. But I'm going to do my goddamn best. Need some sleep. And squish. The controller is vibrating like a son of a bitch. So we all know where this uh, this leads, unfortunately. Why do you bite me? What do I do? What am I gonna do?
phones around. That's weird. Okay, right, we are in the shoes of Leon S. Kennedy. Unfortunately, I don't find him as attractive as Claire, so that's always a downer, straight away, but I've noticed he's not wearing his police uniform. He's just in his, in his, in his civvies. Okay, right, so, looks like a very similar situation, in fact, identical to Claire's. So there's probably not going to be anything out here, I don't think. But um, but Leon doesn't drive a bike. No, what? Drive a bike? Ride a bike? He's got his little jeep. Which is very cool, very nice set of wheels there, Leon. All right, let's check out the gas station. See if I remember how to play. Hello. Anybody there? Hmm. Something's not right. You don't say. <laughs> you don't say, Leon. What tipped you off? All the blood everywhere, or... I don't know. Anyway, so, I'm guessing... Even though at this point we can't... Get our gun out, I'm guessing Leon does have a gun. Claire had a gun, so Leon's probably got a gun. I mean, he is a cop after all. That would make sense. Um, I didn't really take... To, hello. Didn't take the time to look around this too much, did I? When I was Claire, I was too terrified. So, that's one thing I'm going to say, is... I'm going to be less scared, I think. <laughs> I mean, like I said, I think the enemy placement is different. But... This looks awfully familiar, yeah. You are right? He's not alright, man. He's really not okay. And this is something I... I'll be back for you. I don't think I picked up on this last time, but this dude locks you in. Like, if we go down this way, he's gonna shut the door on us. Yeah. Hey, we try and open what are you it. Doing? Yeah, exactly. It's like, what the fuck, dude? So, yeah, that's something I picked up as Claire on the second playthrough I did. Okay, so my plan is right. We're gonna we're gonna get accosted by this zombie. Stop moving, officer. You need help. Stay back, sir. I got this. You ain't got shit, buddy. You got a nice hickey on your neck now, though. Hello, handsome. Oh God. Hardcore Freeze. zombies. I'll shoot. Right, I've remembered how to headshot. Son of a bitch. Oh shit, that's not good. Don't really want to be missing. Why won't? Oh shit, it's not L1 to sprint. My bad. Too oh, used to the, the Last of Us. Damn it! Oh, you son of a bitch. Oh, already down to danger. That's not good. Damn it! Oh my god, I can't. <laughs> this was a bad idea. What the? All right, he's down. Okay, we have one bullet left. Now, hopefully, we won't need to deal with any more zombies if I'm quick enough on this next bit. But man, my aim needs to improve. So what we gotta do? We gotta grab the key, and then I think we can just run straight to that door, use it, and pray to God we don't get caught by something. God damn! Still, still the same. Oh, I mean, holy fuck! Right, got the key. And that dude in the thing is gonna get up. And he's gonna be like, hey Leon, I ain't dead, bro. Use the key, still love this key animation. And now we run this way. Because otherwise that dude on the right's gonna grab me. Ooh, shit. 
Oh, look who it is. Don't shoot. Get down. Ah, nice little twist. The inverse. You all right? Yeah, I think so. Thanks. You can thank me later when we're safe. Holy shit. I hope my TV isn't too loud, guys. I do need to be able to hear this goddamn game. Come on! Get in! Hold on. Now we make our escape. So, very similar. they'll have some answers at the police station. Wait, you're a cop? Yeah, Leon Kennedy. You are? Claire. Claire Redfield. She's so pretty. Live around here? No. I'm looking for my brother. He's a cop too. Well, it's a good thing we found each other. I don't know what to expect anymore. Ho ho ho. Right, well, we've got the opening intro here. I'm just going to skip this, because that'll just be the same. Can we skip it? Yes. Attention all citizens. Due to the citywide outbreak, you were advised to take shelter at the Raccoon City Police Station. Free food and medical supplies will be provided to everyone in need. God, this is so unreal. Police station's not much farther. They'll know something. Yeah, but what if we're the only ones? What if there's no survivors? No, there's survivors. It's a big city. There has to be. Leon doesn't look as much of a dweeb in this one, does he? Walking from here. Hello. More like running. Yeah, good call. Oh, Jesus Christ. Ah! Leon, you gotta back up. Are you about to get trucked in the ass? What the? Get away. Claire! Claire, are you okay? Yeah, I'm alright. How about you? you? Can't stay here, it's not safe. I'll be there. Alrighty, holy shit, that's a lot of dudes. Right. Control. Run through the streets, look how shiny and wet we are. Oh my god, I've missed I've missed this game. It looks so good. Right. And now I know where to go. I don't know is there any items in the streets at this stage of the game? Shit. I can never be I'm never brave enough to look around. Get to the safety of the police station, especially on hardcore mode. I don't want to be messing with anyone it if I can help it. Station. 
So yeah, when do we get our police uniform? Well, I guess we find the police uniform. Ooh. Don't grab me, don't grab me, don't grab me. Safe. Four. Welcome to your place of work, Leon. Welcome to your first day on the job. Now again, I think I looked around here, but there wasn't anything at all. That's Claire. I'm guessing that's going to be the same in this one. I mean, I don't even really know if item placement is the same. I would assume for the most part it will be. But yeah, Leon's not quite the, uh, the dweeby was in the original, but he's not quite action hero super soldier like he was in RE4. I'm glad they sort of found a nice middle ground. He just looks like a normal dude. And the police station. Right, so... If I remember correctly, we go through that way first. Hello? Is anybody here? Um, and I, I can't actually hear the music, like, if there's any... Oh yeah, I can hear the original now. Excellent. That's brilliant. Oh, I'm so glad they added that. And we have ink ribbons. There we go. Oh, and the classic inventory sounds that I'm only just hearing now. Okay, cool. So, let's um, examine the computer. I'm going to have to turn my TV down a bit again. I really... I'm going to try and avoid any echo for you guys. I'm really sorry if there is any. There has to be someone here. Not good. David! Marvin! You there? I found a way out! It's in here! Oh yeah, this is half cop. Send reinforcements! East hallway! The guy that couldn't pull himself together. I gotta find that guy. He definitely is gonna rest in pieces. Let's, um, chuck away this key. Oh, and yeah, now I've installed all the add-ons and stuff. We could use these pistols instead of our regular 12-shot capacity 9mm, which is called Matilda, by the way. That's an adorable name for a gun. Makes me think of The Professional, which is a great film, Leon the Professional. Um, but I don't know. Maybe we'll save these until one of the other runs of the game. Let me know if you want to see those. Right, store the key. Ink ribbon, probably should save. I'm just saying. Although one nice little thing is we're back to full health. Once you get to, you know, past the prologue of the gas station, your health goes back to full. Which is nice. Uh, was there anything around here that I want to pick up before I save? Now, saving is going to be something I try and do as little as possible. Obviously, because it is a limited supply of ink ribbons. But, I will say this... In my Claire run, I always had, especially like towards the end of the game, I had a lot of ink ribbons. Now we have this puzzle as well. I wonder if I can remember the medallion uh, thing for this, for the lion. I don't think I'm going to be able to remember that. It's been so long. No, we'll just wait until we get the, the dude's book. Uh, I think there was some ammo this way. Now, I do also have a bunch of, well, like, a couple of costumes for Leon that we will try. Oh, there's not. Was it the other side? Might have been the other side. Wasn't anything in here, was there? Oh, herbs, yep. Yeah. Okay. Sweet. Ah, and there was this safe that I never managed to get the combination for as Claire. I'm gonna try my best to get it this time. Um... Guide pamphlet. I'm not going to bother reading a lot of the stuff now because it's going to be the same. 
Okay then, so we'll go the other side, we'll see if we find any more pistol ammo. How much have we got already? Oh, just one bullet. Ugh. That's not good, Leon, my man. Uh, nice, uh, nice trainers, by the way, or sneakers. That's the library door. Ah, and there is ammo. Good. Need that shit. Only five bullets, but I'll take it. Yeah, that classic music is awesome. Alright, Leon, when the hell do we get our police uniform? Or is, are we in this for the rest of the... I don't think we are in this for the rest of the game. Because if I go to the menu... And check the costumes, it's got normal outfits. And he's definitely in his RPD... Uniform there. That's weird. Whatever. Okay, right. I think we'll go save. We'll go save, and then we'll go try and save. <laughs> we'll save, and we'll save the carp, although not really. So, we'll keep the herb on us. Use one of our ink ribbons. So, as you can see, I've got my hardcore Claire file. And then I had her standard one. We're just going to overwrite the top one. Ooh, I'm excited! Although I am absolutely terrified, because hardcore mode ain't no joke, guys. Oh! Oh shit, there's a freaking first aid spray. Completely forgot about that. I'll keep that on me as well, but we must put our ink ribbons away. Because space is pretty limited at this point. So there we go. Alrighty then, Leon, let's do this. Oh, and do we go? Getting all that hepatitis again. Okay. So, okay, there shouldn't be anyone to worry about until we get to the room, the watchman's room. Uh, so we need, yeah, we still need to find, obviously we're going to we're gonna need to find all the stuff, mage. Um, so there's the fuse missing. A lot of scary noises. I don't know if there was any items here. You got this. You got this, Leon. I mean, if you could see yourself in the future, how you are in RE4... RE4 Leon would eat this place for breakfast. Like doing suplexes and all sorts of crazy shit. Right, now this is, yeah, this is the press room. This was where I found one of the secret photograph locations. But I don't think we can grab it now, because we don't have the photo to tell us where it is. But it's like in, I think it's in this desk, or somewhere in this room. Ah, more bullets. Yes, ten of the bastards. Now, one thing Leon definitely has an advantage over Claire is just the number of bullets in a clip. Her pistol is pretty shitty. Leon's looks to be... I mean, I don't know if it's as powerful, but it's definitely got more shots in the clip, so... I'm happy about that. Nothing else in here. Never did... Oh yeah, this is just a light switch. That does help. Uh, nothing else. So, I mean, as we're about to see, I'm hoping this will work. This room could actually be a lifesaver for me very, very soon. <sighs> Man, I'm so nervous. Because, <laughs> oh, I mean, I know I've only just saved, so we won't have to redo much at this point, but eventually it's going to get to a stage where, like, I haven't saved in like 20 minutes and I'm doing some really risky shit that's when I'm gonna be terrified um, check the toilets you perv Leon you perv fucking hell god damn doors now isn't there another first aid in here somewhere yes there is 
Oh boy, do we need that. That's the source of the flood. Okay. So... So far, so good. Don't think we need to worry about these guys just yet. Jesus. Jesus. Oh, and we need the wire cutter for that. Open up! Hurry. Oh shit. Open up! Yeah, yeah. Open this goddamn door! It ain't gonna help you, buddy. I know your fate is sealed. I'll get you out! You know what this favorite uh, this guy's favorite meal deal is? Half uh, half price? Also, I don't know. Anyway, that was a, that was terrible. That was a terrible joke. I should have said something like, yeah, th this dude is, like, half off or something. I don't know. What I do know is that he's fucked. So much raspberry jam. Everywhere. Ooh. That were me, I'd puke all over his face and faint. <laughs> right, we got we got bigger problems, Leon. We need to get back to the safety of the uh, the lobby. I mean, you got to give it to the guy; he had guts. Uh, did I make that joke last time? I can't remember. Right, officer's notebook. Good. Oh shit, we have to deal with this prick. What about this guy? Uh oh. Get down, right. Just running. Just running. Not dealing with any of this shit. I'm gonna make a run into this room. We should have some company. Dun dun! Dun dun! <laughs> the classic music's so funny. Definitely not as scary. Hello! Right, are there any more of you out there? Fucking should be. Oh, I thought there was more than that. I think I'm in trouble. Oh shit. Oh shit. Hey, buddy. Right, come over this way. Come over this way. Not another one! Oh, I'm so screwed. Oh, I'm not screwed. I'm not screwed. Run. Oh my god, we did it. Holy shit. Now that's something I learned playing through the hardcore mode with Claire. That, that room is a godsend at that point. Thanks, Marvin. You're safe. For now. Thanks. Marvin Brown. Leon Kennedy. There was another officer I, I couldn't... I couldn't... Here. <clears throat> I'm sure you did what you could, Leon. Does anyone know what started this? Not a clue. Ah. But honestly, all you need to know is that this place will eat you alive if you aren't careful. Yeah, well, I was supposed to start last week, and I got a call to stay away. I wish I'd come here sooner. You're here now, Leon. That's all that matters. Okay, Lieutenant. I'm ready. Hopefully you'll be able to find a way out of this station. That officer you met earlier, Elliot. He thought this secret passageway might do the trick. Mm. This is good news. We can get you to a hospital. No, no, I am not the priority here. Lieutenant, I'm not just gonna leave you here. I'm giving you an order, rookie. You save yourself first. I'd come with you, but I'd just slow you down. Now, you'll need this. I can't take it. Stop. And don't make my mistake. If you see one of those things, uniform or not, 
You do not hesitate. You take it out. Or you run. Got it? Yes, sir. Well, I'm going to be running a lot. Uh, a hell of a lot. All the time. This is Snake, telling you to subscribe to Mage Masher 22 on YouTube and Twitch. Snake out.